Hi, this is Andrew with Triple Five Gear. Today I've got something a little different. I want to do a behind the scenes and share something about myself that maybe you don't know about me. As you know, as a YouTube reviewer, uh, I'm something of a knife nut. Uh, this is the Emerson CQC7 from uh, 99, actually, one of my older knives in my collection. Um, and I'm also just kind of a gear junkie. I did a pocket dump before I started, and I've got this awesome Keras Customs Bolt pen made in Arizona. An outstanding, beautifully machined pen. Uh, I do in-depth gear reviews where I try to appreciate craftsmanship. But one thing maybe you don't know about me is that as I have grown to appreciate craftsmanship more, I've acquired a desire to become a craftsman. And that's one thing that I really have not been able to pursue in any serious way at all. Now, what you've got uh, in front of me is a very old grinder. This is a, a grinder that my father-in-law gave me. It's a, a Dayton grinder made in Illinois. An amazing grinder uh, for very simple things. I reprofile axes with it and play with it, basically. Very simple machine, very simple tool. Uh, I'll be rolling in some footage of me working in my garage with this on my uh, workbench, which is probably smaller than some Medford knives. And uh, the fact that uh, I only have this grinder is somewhat uh, inhibiting uh, for uh, the ability for me to grow as uh, a knife maker, which is something I'm interested in growing and uh, eventually being able to uh, do someday. Which brings me to the point of this video. Medford Knives is giving away a Burr King grinder. This is a serious grinder that enables you to do both uh, convex and flat grinds. And uh, it's a single speed grinder, it's an older one, but it's something that would enable you to uh, finish a knife as well as just, uh, for example, cut out blanks, uh, that kind of thing, um, rough out uh, a blade profile. And so it's something I'm uh, really excited to uh, get involved with. Uh, they're asking for a story, and my story is that I appreciate gear, but I don't have a ton of skill in terms of actually crafting gear, and that's one thing I'd like to change. Uh, my support, of course, is all of my awesome subscribers. I have nearly 2,000 subscribers. Going to be there real soon, I think. And, uh, you know, there's for sure a core group of you that are always commenting, always saying supportive things. And I know you would love to see me actually take some of what I'm doing on this channel to the next level. And so that's where the potential, the follow-up comes in in this, uh, in this video, is that um, if I am chosen by Medford Knives to be given this awesome Birkin grinder. Um, I'm going to document my progress on my YouTube channel here. And I'm going to give away the things that I think are worth giving uh, once I acquire some basic knife making skills. And my skills are very minimal at this point. So what I can promise is uh, both sharing my progress with uh, MKT um, as well as with all of my uh, supporters here on YouTube and eventually giving away some of the fruits of eventually becoming a knife craftsman. So if you want to help me become a knife maker, follow up on something that I uh, am interested in and would like to improve on, please follow the links below to the Medford Knife Giveaway and vote on uh, the videos or the pictures that you like the most. You know, if you want to vote for me as a subscriber, that's really great. I appreciate it. But I want you to just support some of these budding knife makers that are also getting involved. If you choose to vote for me, that would be excellent. If you choose to vote for someone else, you're still getting involved with what I think is a great opportunity from Medford Knife and Tool. So anyway, a little behind the scenes, a story about myself and uh, possible future interests and uh, channel theme. I really want to thank you for your support, whatever support you can give. Please give me a thumbs up and share this video if you found it uh, interesting. And uh, thank you very much. I look forward to uh, hopefully sharing more knife making or craftsmanship uh, ideas in the future. 